An advisory has also been issued to the pirates saying that Iran has now closed the country's airspace after the Israeli air strikes. The advice and the advisory in fact has been uh, at the coming after the Is Iran's airspace defense system have been attacked severely in the wee hours of Saturday and in fact this is now pushing in only more difficulties for Iran. Although Iranian media has also confirmed that there have been attacks at these bases targeting the defense system that was put in place and the blast due to the activation of the air defense system in Iran. All right, joining me on the broadcast once again is my uh, guest Shiodan Singh. Sir, I welcome you back. At this point of time, uh, the West Asia has been on the edge in the anticipation uh, you know, of Israeli retaliation for the ballistic missile and the missile barrage which was carried out by Iran on October 1st. And it's, this is in fact a tit for tat mo uh, mo moment at this point of time. But uh, as the airspaces are also shut in Iran, what is the next that we can expect at this point of time? Uh, is, there, is there any sort of a breakthrough that is in sight and can be put in perspective? You see, by shutting the airspace, Iran, Iran cannot close the, the attacks of missiles and rockets because they uh, shutting of the air space means that they will try to shoot the attacking missiles or rockets. So it will con continue if, if Iran retaliates this strike, then Israel will also retaliate and double the um, quantum. So this war will carry on for very long because this is uh, such a war in which only missiles and rockets are being used. So sitting in their own countries, both the countries are firing on each other and destroying the humanity in, in, this, West, in this West Asia. And it's very unfortunate that such a oil rich area is being disturbed and put on the, on the unrest. So it is going to affect the complete world economy. And since the oil uh, production will be affected by all these strikes, so this will be a sort of a further destruction of humanity. All right. Mr. Singh, in fact, uh, how you have made this understanding of what's happening in West Asia is something to be think over. Uh, but uh, as we can understand that there is no concrete response from the Iranian uh, forces and in fact Iranian authorities, they have confirmed that there are attacks that happened and but they did not confirm immediately about uh, you know the kind of response that uh, uh, has been in fact expected after Israeli uh, uh, forces have conducted this precise airstrikes. Do you expect any resp uh, any kind of a uh, um, response that can be uh, given by the Iranian state media and ir Iranian authorities as well? You see, Iran has brought these terrorist group like Hamas and Hezbollah. So Iran has got many ways to answer Israel. It most probably he will encourage Hezbollah and Hamas to further launch offensive against Israel and it will be again in the same way like uh, missiles and rockets and uh, is, uh, Iran directly will fire only when these uh, attacks are failing from Hamas and Hezbollah. So it will be continue war and it will carry on for indefinite period. For more such videos subscribe to the NewsX YouTube channel hit the bell icon.